We've been converting tiny whoops to hovercrafts for years. What if I tell you that the hovercraft is not the only thing you can make out of the tiny whoop? Because what I have over here is the flying wing made with tiny whoop parts. It's interesting how you convert a tiny whoop and originally this was the Emax Tiny Hawk 2 into the Flying Wing. All you have to do is you have to take the flight controller and the ESC, install motors in the correct order, add some 6mm foam as well as the fuselage of this thing and you are done. The most interesting thing about this build is that there are no servos. Everything, the stability and the control is obtained only thanks thanks to the motors, four motors directly taken from the tiny whoop and oriented at a certain angle. So you have two motors pointing up and when they spin faster you have pitch up, you have two motors pointing down, those are the two on the opposite sides and when they spin up the whole thing's noses down and of course the same goes for the roll and on the yaw because this thing also has the yaw stability and funny fact this thing runs 100% clean beta flight even the beta flight while installed on this thing still assumes that you are flying a quad because thanks to the correct orientation of the motors it behaves in the air like a quad. The only thing that is left is to fly this thing because what I'm gonna do in just a second I'm gonna put the camera on my forehead and try to maiden this thing. Um, the wind is maybe slightly too strong for uh, really those small flying wings but because it has the three axis stabilization it might even work. Let's just see what's gonna happen. Ah! Oh it's bloody amazing! Okay, okay, this is something, uh, probably I have to throttle up a little, but this looks kind of promising. Okay, the second attempt, this time I will give it slightly more throttle and let's hope that the, there will be slightly less wind. It's hard really to control in those conditions because I think the rates are greatly, greatly too high but it's kind of flying! But see how strong the wind is. This thing just stays in place. Okay, let's check if this thing can do a roll. Yeah! Okay, no, it hates the wind. You see, it definitely hates the wind and doesn't have authority to fly into the wind, but it flies. <laughs> I'm following the flying queen. flies. Now that I'm surprised that it flies because before I saw some videos with this thing before but I'm surprised that it was even possible to fly this thing in today's weather because don't get me wrong this thing is only for the super calm weather and maybe even preferably the indoors flying because have you seen how I was running uh, behind the wing? Uh, actually running. I was walking behind the wind so, small, so slow this thing was when going into the wind and the funniest thing was the controls because of how the beta flight handles the authority when you just roll to the side to do a bank and yank it doesn't really want to turn at all if you want to turn you have to use the yaw stick then you yaw and it nicely turns into the left into the right um, this is because that beta flight is not aware that but you can do the bank and yank and when you do it it just wants to stabilize the yaw with counter action of this thing so it's kind of irritating but if you remember that it is a quad because from the beta flight perspective it is a quadcopter just use yaw and do whatever turn you want 
However, I broke mine. I broke mine because one of the motor mounts is right now destroyed. This is not a problem. I will just replace it with some of the spares I have. And then when the next time the weather will be slightly better, I will just try this thing one more time because <laughs> one of the not the best flying, not uh, even well flying, but one of the it has the huge fun factor built into it because uh, look how cute and how cool this thing really is in the air. I'm Paweł Spechalski, thank you very much for watching and until the next one. Bye bye!